Hi, I'm Ben Crippen. And I'm Preston Rogers. And welcome back to your daily announcements. Today for lunch we have mini breakfast bites, scrambled eggs, tri-taters, a juice blend, oranges, and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Hi, I'm Brody Sainer, and these are your top five news stories of the day. Number one, shooting takes place in Monterey Park, California, killing 10 and injuring 10 more. Number two, eggs are being smuggled from Mexico to the U.S. due to high prices and disease. Number three, Chiefs beat Jaguars 27 to 20. They'll face Bengals in the AFC Championship. Number four, Avatar 2 surpasses $2 billion at the box office, making it sixth highest grossing film of all time. Number five, congrats to Brielle Lujan for receiving honorable mention at the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards. Here's our Word of the Week. This week's Word of the Week is pensive. Engaged in, involving, or reflecting deep or serious thought. Next, here's an ACT update. Here's a cultural day announcement. Here's Are You a Trendsetter with Cesar. Um, hi, my name is Cesar Morales and I'm Sophia Gordon. And the question I'll be asking you today is, what is the fashion trend of this year? This. Oh, joggers and... Lakers. <laughs> nice. Um, I would say the new fashion trend for this year is like a guy wearing a hoodie. There's so many guys wearing hoodies now. Hi, I'm Neva Percival. I'm Savannah Burton. And I think uh, wearing shorts during cold weather the new fashion trend and then people wearing hoodies during the summer is also a fashion trend okay bye now here's a rapid fire questions with maggie maggie why um 18 and i'm a senior <laughs> oh, um deca fbla national honor society cross country kind of dabbled in track but i don't do it anymore Next, here's a resume writing workshop announcement. Let's head on over to the weather. My name is Austin Bryant, and the high is 39 and the low is 22. Now for a quick blast of the past, let's wrap up with this day in history. Stay classy, BC. January 25th, 1981. The 52 Americans held hostage by Iran for 444 days arrive home in the United States, reuniting with their families at last. 1971. In Los Angeles, Charles Manson and three of his female followers are convicted of murder and conspiracy in the slayings of actress Sharon Tate and six others. 1994. Also in California, pop star Michael Jackson settles child molestation claims out of court, reportedly paying millions of dollars without admitting guilt. In 2003, Jackson is arrested and charged with molesting a child in a separate case. He's acquitted on all counts nearly two years later. 1959. The jet age takes off in the United States as an American Airlines Boeing 707 makes the first...